all primate species are intelligent. Some use tools, others show self-awareness, and they're good at problem solving. Most live in social structures and family groups. We are primates. When justifying experiments on other primates, they're referred to as the non-human primates. Yet these non-human primates have proved themselves capable of learning rudimentary arithmetic, have demonstrated reasoning, some have even learned to speak in human sign language, and they display similar emotions to us, such as affection, anger, and sorrow, even empathy. But to argue that our similarities justify their use in laboratories is to ignore, at our peril, the fundamental biological differences at the physiological, genetic, and immune system level, which are so important to the outcome of any experiment. But whilst small differences in DNA can make huge differences in experiments, we are close enough to comprehend the suffering of our fellow primates when they're snatched from the wild, when caged, confined, transported, when restrained, injected with drugs, force-fed chemicals, deliberately brain damaged, we know they suffer. We know they suffer as we would. Yet despite this, and that more sophisticated alternatives to animal experiments are available than ever before, the number of primates being used in experiments around the world is rising.